Yeah, school pupils should be able to write programs for computer games, not just play them. That's the view of the Education Secretary, Michael Gove, who wants a complete overhaul of the way computer skills are taught in English schools. The new curriculum, due to be rolled out in the autumn, will be designed with the help of industry and universities. Our education correspondent, Rita Chakrabarti, reports. This is ICT learning the traditional way. But this is the future. It looks like they're just playing computer games. Today we're going to be looking at the instruments of the orchestra. But in fact, this is a music class. At Willows High School in Cardiff, information technology is embedded in lessons, giving pupils an in-depth understanding of how computers work. It's a more proactive approach of learning, which uh, definitely makes it more interesting and uh, more enjoyable. This big technology trade fair is where the Education Secretary chose to attack school ICT. He wants to scrap the curriculum and start again to make computers more exciting. At the moment we're just training children to fill in Excel spreadsheets. What we want them to do is to be capable of designing the applications of the future, not just filling in what someone else has already created. 30 years ago, children learned the basics of computing on the BBC Micro, a machine that inspired a generation to understand computers. Ministers want to return to teaching pupils how a computer works, rather than just using software. Scrapping the ICT curriculum is a bold move, but Michael Gove is confident that he has business, industry and some of the teaching profession on his side. But opinion amongst teachers here was pretty mixed. From a computer science background, I do like that sort of thinking, but I think as they get younger, so in terms of the 11 to 13 year olds, they do need uh, a key base that they need to start off with and going straight into programming will be far too difficult for them to do that. A lot of students know how to do Word and Excel and, and in some cases, particularly outside of the IT lessons, they know more than the teachers do. So we need to make sure that it's engaging and we're stretching them and that they enjoy it. What does Andante mean? Driving this change is the fear that Britain could lose its place as a leader in the technology race if schools aren't more ambitious. Ripping up the curriculum shows ministers think it's urgent. Rita Chakrabarti, BBC News.